What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to go over all the news for Fish Quest Worlds for this week. Let's get into it. First up, we have next week's event, Enter the Void. We'll be fighting bosses from the original Adventure Quest. It's supposed to be very hard challenge bosses, and they'll probably have drops and stuff like that. Very cool. Can't wait for that to be in the game. Yermi says, just about at the end of the rewrite bugs list, unless players have more. Waiting on testers for class bug confirmation. So, I guess the rewrite is almost finished? TM 99.999% finished. Alright, so we might see the server rewrite happen this summer. If all the bugs are complete i mean they're gonna find more bugs once the game actually goes live and they actually get a lot of people playing on the servers but you know it's gonna happen any either it, there's no way to avoid it bugs will be found but it looks like all the bugs that they have found have been fixed so they're just waiting for class balance i guess to be worked out and then rewrite will be live now a lot of people in the community have issues with the rewrite. I'm not gonna talk about that right now. I'm gonna make a separate video about. So here are some cool ass swords, crazy amounts of help from Bido AE with the dragon blades. So this is a dragon blade from Adventure Quest Worlds, and they poured it over to Dragon Fable. I thought I'd just show this in the video. This isn't a new AQW item, uh, but it is Adventure Quest related, and I just love the art style on that. Very cool. And it doesn't fit AQW because, of course, it's a Dragon Fable style, not the Adventure Quest style. We already have the sword in Adventure Quest, but Adventure Quest Worlds, that is. But it still looks really cool. Speaking of blades, here's a new blade that Z is working on. Uh, the animation for it, to be more exact. That animation looks really sick. But later on, he made a switch to the blade on his Twitter. I don't know if it's the same blade or a variation of the blade. But I really like this blade. If Z's watching this. Z, I love your artwork. One and two, uh, you should keep this style of blade. At least that's my preference. I don't know how other people think about that, but uh, yeah, changed it up a little bit. I don't know even know how you put the the same animation on the, that one, but you know, whatever. It's pretty cool. This week, uh, we're having some sets. So there's this set for ACs, and this set will be a boss drop. I think, uh, yeah, from the destroyer. So this will be a boss drop set that will be an AC set. What these look like in-game? Well, here is Elena's character page with the armor. The ears are popping out. Hopefully that doesn't actually happen when the set is in-game. Here's an early look at it. Close up look. Uh, it's on Elena's character page. It should be on there at the time of upload. So if you want to go check it out, yeah, I can. Uh, this is the Friday's release. It looks like that thing is fighting that thing. Pretty interesting. Not really. <laughs> Hopefully it's better than last week's. And uh, since the last news video, if you uh, watch every week, which I upload these every Thursday, the May bonus upgrade has changed. Now, their payment system, if you use your bank account, has also changed. So I use my bank account through PayPal to buy upgrades. I purchased an upgrade, a $10 upgrade, last week. It still hasn't gone through, and it's Thursday. I bought it Friday last week, and it's almost been seven since six days. Still hasn't gone through. It says it takes three to five. It's been six, so it's a little slow. I don't know if that's my bank or Arctic Entertainment's payment system being all messed up right now. But uh, yeah, if you think about buying something, it's a little slower than normal right now, so keep that in mind. Uh, but, you know. If, I think as long as you make the purchase in this month, like if you say like, oh, I bought it that day, like the day the purchase starts, even if the next month the package changes, you'll still get that this one, I think. But uh, yeah, it's only in the middle of the month, so you don't have to worry about that right now. It's a little concern I have about their payment system currently in the game. And now I have special info on this. So I... I was looking at this, you know, and uh, Mother's Day items, seasonal items, I don't think they're going to do any new stuff. Sometimes they do new stuff. Maybe they will uh, for Mother's Day, which is also coming out this weekend. Uh, make sure you got your mother something nice. I was looking, and it says the LQS here. So we're getting an LQS called the Guardian Limited Limited Quantity Shop. Did I say limited twice? Yeah, the Guardian Limited Quantity Shop. Uh, here is an unreleased armor. 
some of my screenshots. That's why I want to hit the button to change it, swap. So there's an unreleased armor, uh, just for your eyes if you want, if you want to know. So in my screenshots, I realized that it said Guardians, right? And I saw this armor that Z made that's unreleased. And it looks pretty Guardian to me. It's an unreleased armor. I don't know if Z made it. Maybe I got that wrong. But one of the artists for Adventure Quest Worlds made this and posted this to Twitter. This could be the armor that is in the limited quantity shop. It's got an animation on the arm. It looks really sick. It looks like it's worth ACs, in my opinion. So this could be the armor for the limited or uh, yeah the limited quantity shop just throwing that out there and that's the last piece of news i have for today now i tweeted at elena right before i started recording this so i haven't got a response yet but if you check my twitter uh, link in the description i might get a response on whether or not they're doing a custom weapon raffle that's why i'm uh holding my pink sword here a custom weapon raffle uh they did it for two months uh the first one uh zay one the second one hancock one and it's the 11th of May, and a winner has not been chosen. For the other winners, they were chosen, I think, around this time or a little sooner than this. I think it was the first week of the month, and it's the second week of the month. And we have no winner chosen for the contest for April. So maybe they just did two and they're done with the contest, or maybe they're waiting a little longer. I don't know. Uh, Hancock has his weapon from March, uh, but no one was chosen for April. So... I don't think anyone will be chosen, maybe, uh, but uh, you can check my Twitter for that. Check out my Twitch if you haven't already. I stream about five hours a day on my Twitch, so you can go check that out. Link in the description. And uh, that's all for today. I'll be live streaming the Adventure Quest World update tomorrow, so make sure you guys tune in for that on this channel. And I'll see you guys all in the next one. Leave a like if you liked it. Subscribe if you're not already. Peace.